We were just in New Jersey this morning. <laughs> that was this morning. We were playing at the Exit Zero Jazz Festival in Cape May. If anyone's ever been, it's a wonderful jazz festival. And we uh, were able to go perform at the local high school there for, what was it? It was like a thousand kids or something like that, K through 12. And I had to ask them a couple times, like, how are you doing? What is happening? And then they really, they were allowed to like yell and participate and they got going. But thank you for doing it first time. You guys did an A plus.
it is a joy to be able to make music with this group, and we were very lucky to actually have recorded uh, two of those songs. Plus, we also play three originals up top, a uh, New York Naughty part-time drummer and make-believe. So we were able to record a couple songs last month at Atlantic Records. It was part of our prize for winning the NPA's Music Under New York Writer's Choice Award last year. We were voted New York's favorite subway performers. Thank you so much. So we were able to get in the studio, record those songs, and we will be able to release them hopefully later this year. Or is that we cross your fingers? Cross your fingers that the Republic Mouth allows to release these later this year. So uh, the other two songs, the other two originals, New York Naughty and Part Time Drummer, are already released. They are on our first ever album, Black and Gold, that we released last year. It was an entirely self produced, self marketed, self recorded full length album, and we are so proud that it is out in the world. You can find it on Apple Music and Spotify, and you can also find it, if you're a big physical music fan, you can find it on CD and vinyl, which we have for sale outside. The vinyl are all one of a kind. They are all unique black and gold pressed vinyl. They look amazing, and they include all our original songs and then a digital download to download the rest of the album. I think we have a couple signed copies for sale. We have one. Make it signed for the album. We could make more. <laughs> we're happy. We know how we're getting really good at signing things. We're going very fast now. Um, but so we're so happy that Black and Gold is out in the world. We'll actually play our last original from that, um, maybe towards the end, and it might have some lyrics. And it, I highly encourage you, if you catch on to any lyrics we sing, feel free to sing along. We love it when people sing together. That's better, right? When we're all singing along as a group. Yeah, you don't have to be a choir person. Who, were any of us in choir? No. I did not get into choir. <laughs> you did So they were like, you failed really to be on purpose? <laughs> it was at 7 a.m. and that was not okay. That's, that should be illegal. That's not okay. <laughs> Who gets up at 7? All right. Now, we're going to go back in. We're going to have some fun. We're going to go back into the New Orleans, New Orleans and the pop realm. New Orleans? We've been debating on how to pronounce New Orleans. Either New Orleans, New Orleans, or Nauls. Nauls. So pick your own, pick your own adventure. But we're gonna get back to that music. You ready, Brass Queen?
you all so much. Can you give yourselves a round of applause for being here tonight? We so appreciate you being here to support live music. We have been a band for five years. March was our fifth year anniversary. We started in March of 2019. And to be here with all of you is just what we always wanted to do. It's our mission in life is to promote this female-led band, this female musician. And to be here at the Bruner Walter Auditorium at Lincoln Center is a dream come true. Can we please also give it up for the Bruner Walter Auditorium for hosting us and Chamber Music New York for putting on this free concert series. We love music in New York. Nothing better. Thank you for having us. This, again, this is our mission. This is what we'd love to do more than anything in the world. So thank you for taking your time to support us. Now, we have something very exciting that I don't know if we've ever done before. Uh, we over-programmed for tonight, so now we only have time for one more song, so you, the audience, get to choose your own adventure. Oh, wow. Okay. Okay, so this is, oh my gosh, wow. <laughs> okay, so our three options are, I'm going to start from the last first. It is uh, a song called Can't Let Go by Grammy-nominated New Breed Brass Band. That's option one. Option two is Brass Queen's classic, Lady Marmalade. <laughs> and option three is our signature New Orleans meets New York meets Beyonce, Love on Top. Do what you want to mash up, love how you want to. All right, votes for Can't Let Go, number one. <laughs> yeah, we can make some noise. Uh, votes for Lady Marmalade, number two. to do before we hear that song, and that's to introduce you to the Brass Queens on stage right here. <laughs> Starting on my right, you're left with Stoney Young on trombone. Yeah. 